everyone, I'm Crystal from Marshall University's Information Technology here to update you on the Microsoft Authenticator's new method called number matching that's now enabled for all Microsoft Authenticator app users. So if you don't know what I'm talking about or if you don't know what MFA is, it's just an additional layer of security to make sure you are who you say you are. The Microsoft Authenticator app that you may have on your phone formerly sent a notification asking for approval of a sign-in attempt. Often what happens is you're busy and you just click on it and you're assuming and just approving just because it's normal to get those types of messages on your phone. Now you'll see a number and you'll have to associate that with the sign-in attempt where your MFA app is needed to verify your identity by entering the number displayed on the sign-in screen in the MFA app. This feature is critical to protecting against MFA fatigue attacks meaning that you get a little tired and you're just approving things without thinking. Another measure that's been taken includes users seeing the application and geographical location of the sign-in attempt. The only thing you need to do to prepare is make sure that your MFA app is updated and that you're signed in with your ImmuNet account. As always, if you need any assistance, please reach out to our IT service desk at 304-696-3200 you can email us at itservicedesk at marshall.edu or visit us on our website for a live chat at www.marshall.edu slash IT.